In this section of the tutorial, we'll modify the master page so that the policy search page is the application default page and add an application menu for creating a new policy. In the user interface tab, open the master admin page. In the layout tab, in the menu bar at the top, select menu item 1. We're going to give that a name and create menu items under it. In the properties pane at the bottom, for label, enter policies. Now in the menu bar, right click on the new policies menu and select insert submenu item. This creates the first menu item under policies. In the properties pane at the bottom, for label, enter new policy dot dot dot. Don't forget the dot dot dot. It performs no function, but it's a long-standing user interface standard that tells the user to expect a modal dialog to appear. Under the link section at the right, for link destination, select page, and select the page selection radio button. Now, click the selector button at the right, the dot 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 button, and select create policy then click finish. Now add another menu item. In the menu bar select the policies menu again. The policies menu should be open. Right click the new policy menu item and select insert menu item after. In the properties pane at the bottom for label let's enter search dot dot dot. Don't forget the dot dot dot. Now link it to the policy search page. Here's a little tip. Just because the default master page provides a navigation menu widget, it doesn't mean you have to use it. For example, if you're configuring an application that will be accessed from a tablet device, you might want to replace it with a series of large icons or just have a home button and make the default page the navigation page. You can also get really fancy and use HTML to completely control the layout of some of the master page area. Now let's configure the application default page to be the policy search page. So select the basics tab. The fourth field down is the application default page setting. Click the page radio button and now click the selector button at the far right to select the page. Select policy search and finish. Save the changes and close the master page editor. Earlier we showed you that the master page reacted by hovering over menus instead of reacting by clicking on them. Let's show you how to change this behavior now so that it reacts to clicks instead of hovering. Open the master admin page again. Click on the black area outside of any menus. In the properties pane at the bottom under the layout and behavior section, change the submenu display from on hover to on click. 